Anyway, David's been on the department for a number of years. He's one of our most resourceful police officers that we have. Very involved in the training aspects with canine and stuff like that. But for this month, he is a recipient of the Officer of the Month Award, so I'll go ahead and read that. Dear Officer Hall, supervisors in your chain of command are recommended that you be commended for your actions during the month of May 2011. As a result, you were named the Citizens Advisory Committee's Officer of the Month. On May 2011, you were dispatched to a call for service at a, a trailer fire at the Fairhope Trailer Park on Greeno Road. At the time the call, dispatch advised that the residents may still be inside. You responded to the call and arrived on the scene prior to the arrival of the fire department. After determining that the occupants had, in fact, escaped the residents, you retrieved your fire extinguisher from your patrol car and entered the residence to find that the central air conditioner was on fire. You were able to distinguish the fire prior to the fire department arriving on the scene. Your actions certainly prevented more damage to the residents as it had been proven many times in the past that a tra trailer fire has a propensity to burn extremely fast and in most cases never safe. Um, I saw a trailer fire early in my career and it probably went up in about three minutes and the entire sides melted. It, it's, it's one of the most bizarre fires you'll ever see. Very, very hot. On May 11, 2011, you were dispatched to a call for service of a female calling for help on Greeno Road. Officers arrived on the scene but were unable to locate her. You continued to look for the female and found her at the Rock Creek subdivision. While speaking to her, you were able to determine that she had some sort of mental illness. Upon further investigation, you were able to locate the family members in Florida, and you were told that she lived in Spanish Fort. The female's mother was contacted, but due to her age, was unable to drive to Fairhope to get her. Without thinking about the situation twice, you took the female to Spanish Fort and reunited her with her mother. Your hard work and determination definitely helped in the safe return of the female. You are a credit to our department and the entire law enforcement community. These actions are in keeping with the finest traditions of professional policing, and I commend you for your compassion, selflessness, and willingness to serve and protect others. Sincerely, Phil.